I know what some of you are thinking. You're thinking, come on, Kent, not another video harping on keeping your drains clear. Well, I just have to show you this. I've seen some bad ones in the past, but this wagon here has been in the shop for a month. And you got to see this. You will not believe it. I'm actually surprised that there aren't mosquitoes growing in here. <laughs> Look at this. Oh, what a mess. Oh, we lost our tag. No, that's gone. But any of these old Mercedes, whether it be a sedan or a wagon, have drains in these sidewells, either in the trunk or the back, like you see here, and they get plugged up with dirt and silt. So if you have rainwater leaking through your seals, it's going to settle right here and it's going to end up looking like this. So I've got a big catch pan underneath. I'm going to find the hole here. I'm just going to see if I can clean this out. I think what I'm going to have to do is reach underneath Wow, this one is really plugged. I think the rubber grommet is shot, so I'm going to go ahead and just push it out anyway. There it goes. And we'll clean this mess out, and then I'll show you where those drains are located. On the W123 wagons in particular, you might want to pull that spare tire out once in a while and clean this area. And I can't believe what I've seen underneath these spare tires. But look at all this junk. I mean, I'm not even sure how all that got in here. But the drain is located right here. It's a rubber grommet that has three small holes in it. What I usually do is take and punch it out and make one large hole. I'd rather have the moisture drain out and then get plugged up in the future. So please, folks, once again, make sure to keep an eye on your water drains.